All right, guys, welcome to my morning update, and here we are. Here we are with um, what I was hoping was going to be an awesome day, but what happened was when I woke up, I found this, this pile of garbage right here. It was supposed to be a very nice shell for my Kyosho Mini Z or WL toys or whatever I could use to put this on top of. But what happened was, and um, most people wouldn't know uh, what happens, but if you look at this shell very carefully, you'll notice that on this side everything seems pretty smooth. And then by the time you get over here, you notice there's some layer shifting going on here, and there's a problem right there. And what happened was, it would seem that when the first layer was put down, uh, this part lifted off, and so when I tried to glue it back on, it still wasn't that good and so as it progressed it did perfectly fine until this point right here where you see this line and then at that point right there uh, it probably came off the build plate again and since I was sleeping and I left this on overnight um, then it kept moving around and so as it was building these last layers eventually this part got a little bit too high and the build and the nozzle, yeah, and the nozzle, or the hot end, smacked against this thing hard enough, and it just ripped it off. You see, there's a lot of melting right here, so most likely, this part here is the culprit right there. As it's making this turn here, this part here got lifted up, so it's higher up, and it dragged it off the whole build plate. Well, uh, that's that. But the good. The good part was that I eyeballed this and um, looks like it would actually fit on top like that. Now it wouldn't be right, like it would have to be readjusted because as you see here, the wheel are not centered on this thing. But generally speaking, the size of it is just larger than, than that and um, it would probably fit on one of these. Let's see if the wheelbase is a little bit better here. This is more accurate here. So it would still have to be a little bit larger to fit on here. But it would look really cool. So it would have to be just a little bit larger for this setup right there. Since the wheelbase is a little bit different. Uh, and then it would, it would do pretty well there. Anyway, that's the update there. Um, I also have this funny little solar powered system so I was thinking of making like a little drift car uh, that is entirely solar powered but we'll see if that goes anywhere anyway thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next update oh well